Hello everyone, thank you for listening. My name is Josiah and this is my first Moravian College vlog. Oh my gosh, I just saw President Grigsby. Hey. So I want to go to a couple different places that are around campus like nothing too far and places that are definitely drivable for students to like go to, if that's making sense. Like, I hope that makes sense because I don't really know how to use words. But um, so I guess just the first place that's near here, that's near campus is um, Dunkin Donuts. So that's just where I'm gonna be going right now. And right now I'm at a stoplight, but like I will edit this part out and we will go to Dunkin. Yes. Anyway, so I'm pulling in right now. We about to pull in. How can I help you? Hi. Um. So, what kind of different pumpkin stuff do you have here? And that was a hot latte, right? Um. Oh, sorry. No, a cold one. Okay. No. I'm just gonna be waiting. Thank you so much. I have a pumpkin spice latte. This is actually my first pumpkin spice latte in general. I'm at a stoplight, but... Wait, this is actually really, really good. But if I were to rate this at a scale of 1 to 10, I would probably say that this is a... Like a 7. Like, this is good. Oh, wait, I still have munchkins. Oh my gosh, I gotta try the munchkins. Yeah, it's good. They're not the best. I'm not gonna lie. Like, the flavor was there. The flavor was there. But the texture... So it tastes a little dry, a little dry. 4.5, 5. All right, so the next place I'm gonna be going is Panera because I looked up online and they have um like this Panera pumpkin muffin thing and it looks good. So what, what's the worst that could possibly happen Um, that I hate it? Hi, can I please have the pumpkin muffin? That was actually cheaper than I thought. Yes. Thank you so much. It comes in a bag that looks like this. Um, not that that's important at all, but just so everyone knows. So this is what it looks like. All right, but so let's try. Let's try this right now. You should probably eat this with a napkin um, on your lap, just so you, because it's a little messy. It's a little, it's a little crumbly. That's the first thing that I'm noticing. Okay, but I like the design on it. I like, not the design, but I like, the appearance is good. I don't even know how to, do I eat from the top? How do you guys eat muffins? Like, do I eat from the top, the bottom, like, or like the whole thing? It's not bad, but I'm disappointed. Not gonna lie. Maybe I'm just not a muffin person. The most exciting thing about it is probably the appearance. The taste is more like, hey, I'm a muffin that happens to be pumpkin. But like, other than that, it's not doing it for me. Someone's in the car next to me. This is awkward, but I'm just gonna keep going. It's, I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna wait. One second. On a scale of one to 10, I give this a three. And maybe someone who likes muffins will have a different opinion. But me, as a person who, I guess, who's just not a muffin person, I give this a three. Not to say I don't like Panera, because I like Panera, but I just don't like this muffin. So now my next stop is um Starbucks. Do you guys have pumpkin? I'm looking at the menu now. Do you guys have the pumpkin spice latte? Out of all the places that I've been to, this has been the most expensive. So this better be good. Oh my god, I just realized that I'm drinking my Dunkin' right at the Starbucks right through. This is so embarrassing. Alright, thank you so much. The presentation that this gives is nice. Like, it tastes more real than the Dunkin' one. It just tastes less like pumpkin. It's good. It's it's good coffee. Because it tastes more real, I'm gonna give this an eight. I think if you want more pumpkin or just more flavor, probably put more sugar in it. But this is honestly better than the Dunkin' one. So I'm gonna give this an eight. I like this. It's a little more pricey. It's a bang for a buck. Is that the saying? Like you're gonna get your bang for your buck. I don't know if that's how the saying goes, but that's how I'm gonna use it. Like it's good. It's a good latte. It's good. Like I'm not disappointed. So I'm gonna give this an eight. And because of that, I have to give this, I have to make this go back down to like 
a six. Last, for my last stop, I'm gonna be going to DQ Grill and Chill, Dairy Queen, for those of you who don't know what DQ means. Oh my God, you know what I just realized? I've been sitting here and I completely skipped the part where you order. So now I have to go back around and now there's like a line of cars. How did I skip this? How did I skip this part? Like it's literally like right there. Hi, can I have a pumpkin pie blizzard? All right, thank you so much. All right, you too. Okay, so I'm parked and I'm ready. I I don't know why, but I'm so excited. Like, I just feel like this is gonna be it. Let's open it. It's a little, little hard to open, but you know, a minor, a minor, a minor little flaw. Okay, okay. Hmm. This is good. This is good. Wait, 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 this is so good. Yo, this is it. This is it. This is seriously it. Wait, this is the winner. No, like, this is like a 10 out of 10. First of all, for those of you who don't know what a blizzard is, a blizzard's like a milkshake and ice cream kind of, like, thing. I don't I don't really know how to explain it. Like, it's just... It's kind of like ice cream. It's kind of like a milkshake, like, an in-between. Like, it's a blizzard. Like, it's, like, what it is. It's, like, perfectly pumpkin spiced. Like, the perfect amount of pumpkin flavor. But, like, there's, like, this, like, little small cookie crumbled in there like a, maybe a pumpkin cookie I, I, don't, I don't really know what it is but it's like adding a perfect little crunch to it dq got it right oh my goodness the rest of the videos would just be me like me eating this because like it does it deserves that recognition dq you win you win the game all right, so that concludes um, the taste testing portion of the vlog. And just as a little recap, as we saw, I went to a couple different places ar like around campus, such as Dunkin', such as Starbucks, such as Panera, such as DQ. And as we saw, my personal favorite was the DQ Pumpkin Pie Blizzard, but that's just my personal favorite. Um, but now that we finished that, I do also want to include the options that we do have on campus because we do have pumpkin flavored items on campus that people may or may not know about. So now I'm just gonna take you a little tour of a little run through of the things we do have on campus so just follow along and you're gonna see what I'm talking about so my first stop has to be at the star I mean just simply has to be I got a pumpkin spice coffee from here and it is just delicious let me tell you I cannot even believe it and this is just me showing you that I indeed did get a pumpkin spice coffee so here I have a bagel from the star inside is spread across with some pumpkin cream cheese I take a bite out of this pumpkin cream cheese bagel and I am just in shock. It is like flabbergasting. It is amazing. Definitely go try this. So my next stop, as you can see, is the Delights Cafe. Delights Cafe is very convenient because it's connected to the Sally Building, which is convenient for people who want to stop by in between or before class. This next slide here is just me showing you a different entrance to the lights because um there's two. And then this next screen here, I'm just showing you the kiosk with all the different options on Delights Cafe, more specifically the Starbucks drinks, because that's where we have all the pumpkin spice options. We're going crazy here with the pumpkin spice. There's four different options a latte a frappuccino another latte another spice latte four different spice lattes honestly pumpkin spice and everything nice is what i like to say but i ended up going with a pumpkin muffin because i was a little hungry and i was heading to work so this is me heading to work making an awkward face because someone was staring at me then me going back to normal realizing i just don't care because i have nothing else to lose at this point but this is just my commute to work i work in admissions in colonial hall so this is just me walking to colonial hall it's a very nice day a very brisk fall day but this video is taking a little too long so i'm just going to speed this up a little bit so here's me speeding this up oh look at those stairs i hope i don't trip on them because honestly that's something i would do but here i go entering my job here at colonial hall me seeing my co-worker dana love her work love that work she's cheering me on with her pumpkin spice latte from dunk oh from starbucks oops that's awkward Thankfully, Dana was there to record me eating my pumpkin muffin from Starbucks. Now, again, I don't really like muffins, but this muffin was extravagant. Look at my facial reaction here. It was amazing. Love that word. Get the pumpkin muffin, please. But all right, I really hope everyone enjoyed watching this video and everyone gained some insight based on my different opinions on all the different pumpkin flavored items that there are off campus and on campus. If you guys don't already, please follow Moravian College on Instagram and subscribe to our YouTube channel.